The motivation was to uh, position Luxembourg uh, for the next few decades as the European hub in this domain with the potential in the future to create a completely new economic uh, value chain in space. And we are very proud to uh, be part of this very ambitious endeavor that iSpace uh, has started some years ago. The Luxembourg Space Agency is not a traditional space agency as we do not have our own space missions. Luxembourg took the decision to take a more commercial approach to space and help industry develop the technology of the future. We want to develop the space economy that will enable the development of activities in space. And so that's why we're developing a transportation service from the Earth to the Moon to bring cargo from customers who want to uh, be active in uh, lunar exploration. As I Space Europe, our role is to provide the services to the European community. We develop what's called lunar rovers, which means mobile robots that can take cargo and drive them on the surface. In Luxembourg, people say, let's make it happen. At iSpace, we say prove by action. Tenacious is a small lunar exploration rover. It's quite small. It's about five kilograms, uh, about 35 centimeters long. So we designed this to be a very small rover that we can take on our lander uh, and explore the landing site. Basically, we'll have operators here in Luxembourg uh, driving the rover. We'll continue this line of micro rovers, obviously with different payloads, different capabilities, depending on the mission. So we would plan to fly those on future iSpace missions. There are many resources of interest on the Moon. We can use the oxygen and metals that are present in the dust that coats the surface of the Moon. And we're also interested in the water ice that's present in the permanently shadowed regions. This is important because we can use these resources to support human life, we can use it for rocket propellant, and this will allow us to support a future of sustainable space exploration. With our Tenacious rover, um, we will be exploring um, the lunar regolith, which is the soil-like material that covers the lunar surface. Understanding the characteristics of this material will help us not only understand the geology of the moon, but also help us with the design of our future rovers um, and technologies for resource utilisation. It's very important to have a close relationship between the companies, or LSA, Luxembourg Space Agency, and the Ministry, when you speak about collaborating with the ecosystem of space here in Luxembourg. Initially, lunar exploration was really led by governments. Today, we're shifting to a new era of lunar exploration, which includes the new space industry, to leverage the decades of research and expertise that the government agencies have, and mix them with the innovation and agility that commercial actors bring to the table. Space is really an enabler to government's uh, vision and approach to lunar exploration. We need talents here in Luxembourg to build our ecosystem in different areas, such as data, such as space, such as all the economy we have here in Luxembourg. Mm -hmm.